North and South Korea are bitter enemies, but at next month's Olympics in the South, they plan to march together at the opening ceremonies and form a joint women's hockey team as well. As Ben Tracy reports, there will also be an invasion of cheerleaders. North Korea knows how to put on a show. Elaborately choreographed spectacles like this one in its capital are designed to impress the leader, Kim Jong-un. Now North Korea is taking its show on the road, sending its state-sponsored cheering squad to the Olympics. The 230-person squad has been called Kim Jong-un's Army of Beauties. The young women are chosen for their loyalty to the regime and their looks. They reportedly must pass a tough audition to land one of the coveted spots. Ri Sol-ju, a member of the squad in 2005, later became Kim Jong-un's wife. The cheerleaders are part of North Korea's Olympic charm offensive. Its involvement is being negotiated as part of the first talks between the Koreas in two years. South Korea is hoping the detente will jumpstart sluggish ticket sales for the games, which have been hurt by fears of war. These figure skaters are the only two North Korean athletes who have actually qualified for the games, so the cheerleaders will dwarf the actual number of competitors. North Korea's Olympic delegation will also include a 140-person orchestra. No word yet on whether it will play in front of its usual propaganda videos, often depicting North Korea's weapons of war. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Beijing.